Just 30 minutes from then, golfers can tackle one of golf's most unusual hazards, aircraft noise from the fighter jets. The old course at Murray Golf Club borders the adjacent RAF base in the town of Lossiemouth. This golfing venue is unique in that it comes complete with runway lights in the middle of the course. It also offers the rare opportunity to get up close and personal with these amazing flying machines. Depending on the wind, they either take off or land right over the heads of those playing. You can practically reach up and touch them. But Old Murray is not just for golfers with a passion for aircraft. It's a real golfing treat, reminiscent of that other old course down in St Andrews. Looking back from the course towards the clubhouse and distant spires of Lossiemouth, the similarity, in fact, is striking. The layout starts and finishes in the heart of the town, just as the old course does at St Andrews. And the classic stone clubhouse reminds us of the one at the home of Gove. Yet Old Murray would be worth the visit even without the comparison. Designed by no less a figure than old Tom Morris, Murray Old is the most traditional of Lynx layouts, with lots of subtle undulations demanding that you play plenty of those precise little bump and run shots so typical of Scottish golf. You also get a taste of Turnbury here as well, because at the far end of the course is a beautiful lighthouse down by the beach on the shores of the Firth. Visitors are always welcome, and what an opportunity it is to experience one of Scotland's most traditional clubs. It's a traditional Scottish uh, Lynx course and club designed by old Tom Morris in 1889. That's when the club was first formed. A traditional nine holes out of the town, turn round back into the town and finishing the town very similar to St Andrews. So uh, we're very proud of the tradition that we've got here at Lossiemouth. A visit to Murray Golf Club in Lossiemouth is a must for those spending a few nights in Nairn. And incidentally, don't be afraid of those jets. If you're easily startled, just visit on a Sunday when the RAF takes a day off. <laughs>